This is a game of musical chairs or musical poles. It's a common game played by small children where they're actually using chairs and it's the first one to sit on the chair. Whereas this one I use poles uh, to make it a little bit easier for the riders. So I start with the amount of poles that there are for each rider. So for example there's six riders in this group and we start using six poles. It just gives every rider an opportunity to first uh, get to stand beside a pole. The object of the game is to be the last one standing, so each time the music stops, they're to find a pole. So we start with music playing quite loud so that everybody can hear, and obviously you can't hear this in the video, but the riders can. And while ever the music is playing, the riders are to be going round the outside of what I have there is a series of yellow cones, so the circle is quite big to keep the riders out. On, also on that circle are the six poles that the riders will use to stand beside to know that they're still in. So riders will continue to trot around the circle while the music's playing and as soon as the music stops they're all to go straight to a peg and they can go across the circle if they need to once the music stopped. And after everyone is the first round when everyone has had a peg, I'll remove a peg. So there's only five pegs for six riders, meaning one rider won't get a peg. So if they don't get to stand beside a peg, they're out, and I will then take another peg. The same rules will apply, that riders will trot round the outside until the music stops, and I will have removed another peg. And then when the music stops, they race to a peg and there will be one rider left out. So we'll continue doing this over and over again until we're down to two riders. When we're down to two riders, I move all the pegs to the centre of the circle, but I leave the yellow cones around the outside. That keeps the riders on the outside of the circle and it just keeps everybody a little bit safer. And then when the music stops, both riders are to come into the centre of the circle and it's the first one to stand beside the, the pegs or the cones, are uh, the pegs rather. And this game takes usually takes two or three minutes if you've sort of got five or six riders and you can play this several times. This is another game that the kids have a lot of fun at. Uh, at times you do need to make sure that they're not running head on um, and to keep it a little bit safe. Sometimes they can get a bit too excited and um, crash and bash about a bit so you do need to just keep on top of that. But it's yeah another really fun game that kids love.